Morning, welcome to the month of September. Um, this month's going to be a very, very interesting month. We've seen a slight contradiction in August in the stock market. Certainly, um, we've had very um, big geopolitical news, but while this, the stock markets have shrugged this off and uh, made historic highs in the US, the FTSE's uh, up there nearly. Um, so it's an interesting situation. It's worth noting that the volumes in August on the stock market have been absolutely dire, so um, expect money to come back. This is the week, really, um, where people come back to their desks and start trading. However, today is Labor Day in the US, so it will be thin volumes. Probably tomorrow is where we start seeing real money coming back into the market. Um, the standout event here this week is... Um, Draghi, um, is he is he not going to announce uh, some form of monetary stimulus? Is it going to be some sort of unconventional QE, maybe buying government bonds, maybe buying corporate bonds? Um, it's going to be a political hot potato if he does this. Um, while this uh, backdrop of is he, is he not going to do it, the euro is... Uh, pushing, uh, making new lows. I think the market are trying to force him to do it. Uh, the euro is challenging that low of um, that we saw a couple of weeks back. So it's going to be an interesting trade. Um, if Draghi doesn't deliver, it would appear that the market is going to be very disappointed. And if he does deliver, I think the market will stay where it is. So it's a very difficult situation. I think until that, and we see uh, investment managers really sit down and decide which way um, the market's going to do what they're going to do with their money for Q4. Um, I expect it to be quite a whippy week, um, but gradually grinding up. Uh, that's pending any major geopolitical news. The Ukraine situation seems to be getting um, seems to be getting worse, and also the uh, Islamic State in uh, Iraq slash Syria uh, seems to be uh, becoming a, a key theme. Um, have a good week's trading. We'll catch up later.